Welcome back. Today, we're talking about the ultra important fullback position. Left backs and right backs. If you want to see these players, more so in action. I'm talking about that gameplay. Tips, tutorials, advice, all inclusive. Second channel, The Playbook. We have five tiers. Broken, rank one, foot champs, debatable, and the pine. We don't want to be in the pine. Players to cover and it's coming in quick. Bang, bang, bang. No icons in this video. Just get a hashtag organics. Because my eyes look a little crazy. Acuna, Acuna Matata. Could argue for rank one and he could grow he could improve but we gotta rate what we have in front of us trent alexander arnold this is so difficult i like him as a person i've had the pleasure of meeting him two occasions but i don't have that bias i'm not a liverpool supporter and he is debatable at best some might even argue for the pine batcha the frenchman she is good to go she's, she's touching she's debating we're conversating about a rank one decision discard inform stats are fraudulent just my opinion but doesn't stand out for me the italian i've used her but i don't think many of us will have her in a rotation bomb pastor brand new hero you're gonna pay a hero price tag she's truly just foot champs bronze big fan for in real life i think she's phenomenal She's also part of that Barcelona women's crew. EA did her wrong. We should have given her at least something close to an 80, then we would have a different discussion. Henrique, debatable for yours truly. I can understand if you have a foot champs. We got a lot to talk about. End of the video, we will have a review. Jao Cancelo, definitely a fan. I support. So we're gonna give our first rank one. He could still use a promo item. Something that really gave him that extra juice. Stirring something up. A little bit of that chef, not boy RD. Captavia. There is a certain promise. He does have the track record. We're giving him rank one. Carver Hall, probably not rotating him in. Chelwell, no, not happening. Santa Claus, I love this man. Big fan. I can't wait for him to upgrade or more promos. He's become the next Atal, where he's one of those players that's getting that pusher. EA is prioritizing, and I'm here for it. Alfonso Davies, definitely good to go. Crazy athlete. He will burst through all sorts of different spacing and options and creativity and chase back and frustration positioning can be a little bit unpredictable but because of how fast he is he can make up for it he's got enough going for him to keep him at that foot champs level if you're looking for an overpowered fullback that will be competitive and 83 alfonso davies will be that player Dest debatable we'll see as time goes de lorenzo probably be a little bit better but he's still influential fits into syria teams and i actually think his price is even going to drop further value pickups discount shot Shopping. Dodo. Definitely put him into foot champs. Dump freeze or dump prize. We're not going to McDonald's today or tomorrow. Balde. I don't know if it's a hot take, but I thought he was overrated from the rip. Huge upgrade last year from a silver, this year to a gold. I always found that he felt a little lost on the pitch, but that's just my experience. Frimpong. I don't know that I'm giving him even the foot champs. We've already had multiple upgrades. We have a lot of players to discuss today. Did I mention? Comment below. Let me know your thoughts. We encourage discussion as long as you bring logical arguments. Gaia, I'm on board. I don't know that he's getting moved above foot champs. My first instinct says this is where he should be, but he should not be slept on. Same can be said with this Grimaldo, the inform. I've gone up against a few Grimaldo inclusions. He's facilitating and causing all sorts of different disruptions. Gwyn, I don't think so. Hakimi, he's not as good this year or not as overpowered as he was last year. I still don't feel right not having him as rank one. Hector Bellerin, brand new SBC. I know that you're sitting on fodder, or hopefully you're sitting on fodder. EA's been giving out all sorts of different pack opportunities, even if you're not spending objectives. I've already completed the season. Teo Hernandez, yeah, it's gonna be broken. You could argue he's the best of any of the fullbacks. Reese James, I like. I enjoyed using him for a weekend. I felt as if he was reliable, consistent, physical, has a play style plus for jockey. I like him. Maybe that's a hot take. Jordi Alba. If you wanted to put him as debatable, you could, but he's not making teams. Karkawi. She is creme de la creme. The best of the best. A little bit undersized. Not the most physical, but
but tons of play styles, has the ability to dribble, to be involved in attacks, undeniable talent on the wings. And I'd like to be a broken record. The wingers and the fullbacks, they are more involved than ever before. Lamptey, again, undersized, but so fast. And he's one of those players that does work. It feels real, it's authentic, it's organic. Sometimes we get these stats and these upgrades and these shifts and you don't know who to contact. It doesn't match up, it doesn't align. Lamptey is very fast, is I guess the point that we're taking away. Lawrence, the Canadian, the second Canadian dream. Davies on one side, Lawrence on the other. Probably could be considered for a foot champ selection. I'm always looking at the macro. Brand spanking new. I'm not sure that he's in that same grouping to join Karkawi. Karkawi makes me think of Chikawi, and Chikawi was incredible. If you remember the item, oh my goodness. Ah, let's see here. And the stats are real. They're not always, especially when we start getting into these objectives or storylines some of these free items just seem suspect you have questions and you don't always get the answer is there a lot of demand is there a lot of supply apparently today we're teaching economics mace i liked her as well used her off the bench a decent amount she even played as a holding mid for me in the women's team so I i'd say debatable is fair machado big upgrade from a 76 to an 83 and for that reason i want to give him the debate he's not going to be an opening fan favorite doesn't carry the same stat with his name but i like what i'm seeing i thought that he looked as if he could do the job so debatable seems fair nope absolutely not i'm sorry mccabe she was okay i used her again off the bench 85 overall i think we have to give her at least a debatable sector mendy wow just doing mendy s things i would rather have hernandez i would rather have karkawi there's some interchangeability between rank one and broken though you could argue for most of rank one going up and you could also say i don't like hernandez i like to look at broken and rank one as being just clear cut there's more debate than ever when it comes to fullbacks melina as time has gone I think he's become less and less usable. The same goes for this lovely individual, Neville. I'm not changing my tune. Nuno Mendez. He'll catch you sleeping. He's, he's, he's similar to a Frimpong, though. This might be revisited. Probably still the pine. The man can score free kicks. The charger who is fortunate. Can't take that away from him. We're going to give him a little bit of a hero bonus. Gone up against him a few times, and I, th I thought that he looked comfortable, looked confident, looked like he belonged. Definitely had that hero stature. Robertson, not a great year, I guess, for Liverpool fullbacks. Debatable. Doesn't have that eliteness in terms of the pace or the skills or being able to push an agenda, giving me a competitive advantage. It's just options that are better. Rolfo, another one of these Barcelona prodigies. I'm actually going to go as far as putting Rolfo in rank one. She can play as a center mid, she can play out wide. She's a complete package, so balanced. Scott, just off the GP of the, the new hero. Tavernier, making a reappearance. Rhea, I have him as debatable. The Dutchman, just, he's not making teams. I feel like I'm being harsh, but the 81 inform is not going to cut it up. He's not going to break into rosters, starting 11s. He's probably not even coming off your bench. Trippier, I packed him. I have them. If you could find a center mid or a holding mid role, you can't get past or disregard the pace in a position where pace is so important. Wagner, again, not really getting into rotations. I'll give him some MLS love. You could debate it. We could debate it. Kyle Walker, straight to the top. He is so clunky offensively. But to this day, I have not gone up against a more annoying, frustrating, defensive fullback. And last but not least, we have Luke Shaw, who at the very beginning of the game might have had some use but at the moment we've just gotten too many items there's too many players everyone's too affordable you don't need the cheap option is the point that i'm going after this list is not based around price but we must begin with the lower portion, the pine. If you want to make a case for Trippier, I understand. If you're looking at the stats and you see Molina, I get it. I've used him a lot. Even bronze at an 87, you say, Mike, how? That's the reality. This is not a list based on how they perform in real life. Even McCabe, unless you're building a full women's team, she's not going to get in your rotations. With that logic, I might have to move Mace as well, even though she's been good for me. And that could be the bias that I have. If you want to keep her in debatable, I'm good with that. 
Yeah. If you're playing Robertson or Alexander Arnold, you're either on a road to glory and you pack them, or you're a Liverpool supporter. As we scroll, I'm tempted with Selma, but if I move her, do we have to shift other players? I'm actually gonna bring Nuno up to foot champs. Grimaldo is right, Bellerin is right, Lamptey is right. I think I'm giving Mendy the nudge. You're not breaking him down. He's gonna receive some sort of promo and he might end up being a player that's around. He's locked down, he has the expression. He will terrorize down the wing. I like the rank one. Rolfo's a little bit different, but she is that good, at least for me. Foot champs, rank one and broken have some controversy because I know the subjectivity with this position. We are bringing the controversy today. Let me know how you're feeling in the comments. There's a lot of room for these positions. I've got a couple more videos that are being suggested on screen. I would love for you to check those out. If you're new here, it is free to subscribe. And as always, I have a lot more content coming out ASAP, ASAP.